Hi guys, welcome back to Honest Straightforward Reviews. Today I'm super excited just to bring to you guys a quick tutorial on how to copy media into your Final Cut Pro for iPad. Now before I continue, first of all you need to make sure that your hard drive is not in NTFC, okay? Any of the other formats, they should be fine. Uh, you can Google them and they can come up as well. Other than that, now I've got the new M4 iPad with the new keyboard and the new pen and or pencil. And what you guys have to remember is the keyboard has a charging port as well. Make sure you don't plug your SSD into the charging port and actually plug it into your iPad directly. It won't read it otherwise. After that, what you need to do is go into, into your files, okay? And you'll have your hard drive. So this is my hard drive here. After that, go wherever you have all your things saved. So let's say if I wanted to import these, there's two ways of doing it. So first of all, what you can do is you can go, let's say I want to copy some of this stuff. So let's say if I wanted to just copy that. So just go copy and then go into your iPad and I've made a folder here. And you can make a folder just by clicking up here on this thing. So if you click there, you can make a new folder and name it whatever, okay? But I don't want that, so let's delete that. Go into this and then all you do is Command V and you'll have it there. Or you can just second click, secondary click and paste it here. So that's a really easy way of copying it, okay? Onto your iPad. Now, how to uh, have it onto your iPad is what you do is you go into go into iPad and go on new project. So click on new project and after, let's say I want to edit making the M4 iPad unboxing, okay. You don't have events by the way, you can't do much with your library from the Mac either, okay. So custom this, yep, that sounds about right. Yep, continue. Then it'll give you an option where to start, okay? So you can import or not import or have it have a recording from the camera or from photos or start blank. So you go from files and you can go into directly the external hard drive. Go into whatever you need to copy. And I want to copy all of these and you just drag it down. And select these and then just go open and that should just import everything for that project okay and that's basically an easy peasy way of importing it directly from the SSD or have it actually in there now if you forget to import something okay so you go back into files okay so it was on my iPad so I can go, let's say I want to import this and that into this project, boom. Okay, so it's imported here for me as well. It's quite a bit slow compared to Mac. Mac is a lot faster. I've got an M1 Max and it's just heaps faster, but hey, this is what it is. Okay, it's good to see. Now, this is a clip that I always use if you guys are new to the channel or old, you might know this is how I start. So this is good. This is a composite clip where so it's great to see that all right guys that's basically it nice and quick i hope you guys enjoyed it let me know in the comments below what you guys think about it and if you guys need help with anything else thank you so much for watching take good care bye bye